Whoa. That's so cool. I'm loving the design. Oh, oh. Yeah. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Let's React. I'm Kenny and this is my beautiful wife, Montana. And today we're gonna to be reacting to season two, episode 20 of Gravity Falls, Weird Mageddon 3, Take Back the Falls. The finale. The finale. Of the entirety of Gravity Falls. Very cool. I'm so excited. I'm so excited to see how the series ends. I'm sad that it's ending, but I am very happy that we made the friends along the way. Yeah, this has been a super fun show so this far. This has been great, and I've really been enjoying the audience interactions, and it feels almost like the Avatar crew came back oh, for totally. a little bit. And uh, people who love Avatar, by the way, the live action, we're going to be bringing it to YouTube soon. We already have, like, all of it on Patreon, so go check that out. But yeah, the series has been great, and uh, now we have the whole crew back together, and I'm interested to see how this exactly ends. I really don't see a way to take down Bill Cipher. Any thoughts before we jump into this episode? Yeah, I also don't really see a way out. I'm glad Dipper and Mabel are back, like, on the same team. Not that they, like, weren't, but, like, they were, like, having issues. and They, they were a little bit on, on the same team. That's yeah. That's caused this, yeah. I feel like. I'm glad that for the last episode, they're going to be working together the whole time. If you're excited for this final episode of Gravity Falls, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below to uh, see this series and see our next series, which is going to be Invincible. We are really excited to watch Invincible, been looking at it for quite some time, and it's not very long. So uh, after that, we're going to be doing really could be anything. Uh, it could be Dragon Prince. It could be uh has been hotel it could be steven universe it could be the legend of vox machina or really anything else so comment below anything you want to see and we would love to give it a look oh and also these episodes of invincible are already posted to patreon now along with the entirety of gravity falls all right are we excited for the finale of gravity falls absolutely all right let's get it let's go Underheads, this video was brought to you by the incredible members of the Let's React Patreon. If you want access to a ton of exclusive perks, check out the link in the description below. Have a good day, Twinkle Toes. Twinkle Kids, I can't no. believe it. Mr. Pines, it's really you. I've been hugging strangers to practice for this moment. Oh. <laughs> What's everyone doing here? And is Pacifica wearing a potato sack? Hey, even in a sack, I still look better than you. Rude. Hey, is anyone gonna feed me? Larry King's disembodied wax head wants num nums. <laughs> it's all the people from all the past episodes. My bad! Invasive maneuvers! Don't they have the unicorn thing? <clears throat> oh, that'll work. Yeah, alright. Is the intro still changed? No. Oh, well. This is a different kind of different, right? <clears throat> I think there was, this is the long version. Wait, no, this is a different kind of right? different. Right? Yeah. It's less Because they're upsetting. back in it. Oh, yeah, they're, okay. And the music also is a little bit better. Like, it kind of sounds like someone's playing the, like, regular intro and then some random kid is just, like, smashing on the, like, upper register. Yeah. That's so interesting. They made the intro so different. Yeah. I love that. Welcome to what's left of normal around. Oh, the partially petrified unicorn. We have <laughs> several injuries. Oh no. I want the arrow, that didn't look good. Weird Mageddon has taught me there are some battles I cannot win. I am now humble McSherman. <laughs> <laughs> so I was hammering signs out back when the sky Bodacious tea. nightmare. <laughs> what I didn't expect was what happened next. Yeah. Turns out what <clears throat> you and my brother did to the shack made the crazy place invincible to weirdness. That's when Possum Breath over here shows up, leading a bunch of injured stragglers through the forest. Look at kid. a place to stay. And he let them in. The plan's to stay in here and eat brown meat until we run out. Then I vote we eat the Yikes. gnomes. Hey, shh, shh. Stress will make you chewy. Grunkle Stan, hmm. we can't all just hide inside the shack. We got a good deal here. Besides... I'm sure where <clears throat> the rest of the townsfolk are, they're fine. This is Chandra Jimenez reporting live from the inside Still of reporting, wow. That's impressive. Viewers <clears throat> to look away if they don't want to see their friends turned into a twisted throne of human agony. Dad, oh, great problem solving. Deputy Darling! Wait, did he say my... Wait, what did he say? Deputy Darling! I don't Deputy know. Deputy Darling. Uh-oh. And I'm being turned into stone by a oh. flying eyeball. 
Yikes. Cameraman's built different. My parents are bad, but even they don't deserve to be turned to stone. Well, they might, they might deserve uh. it. Our friends need us, but we can only save them if we fight back. Mabel is right. Ford told me before he was captured that he knows Bill's secret weakness. If we combine all of our strength, whatever Toby has, various rashes, then we just might be able to rescue Ford and save Gravity Falls. This reminds me of Baldur's Gate. We're only safe inside. It's not like we could take the mystery shack to Bill. Oh. I think I figured out a way to fight Bill and rescue Ford, but we're all going to have to work together. All right. Don't worry, Ford. We're coming for you. Let me go, you insane three-sided. What is this place? Yep. You're in the penthouse suite, kid. The tip of the pyramid. Have a drink. Make yourself comfortable. You know that couch is oh. made from living oh. human skin? Oh, God. If I'm still alive, you must want something from me. As it turns out, my weirdness can't escape the magical confines of this town. He's being up front with them. Gravity falls, mm -hmm. natural law of weirdness magnetism. Did you find a way to undo it? Of course. There's a simple equation that could collapse the barrier. But I'd never tell you. If you just tell me that equation, finally your dimension will be free. Anything will be possible. Well, that doesn't seem very good. And then like a bad way a party that never ends with a host that never dies you'd be one of us all powerful greater than anything you've imagined you're insane if you think i'll help you he's been rejected his whole life that's the only way i could see him arguing that i'll just fish around and get that equation directly out of your mind oh so you can't enter my mind unless i shake your hand and let you in is that still true i'll make you talk it's only a matter of time Oh, so just torture. Pretty straightforward method. Yikes. robo Jigs. Finally, we're going to use his robotics for good. Doesn't have any gun swords. I watch a lot of anime and trust me. Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah. Anime. We have much to discuss. <laughs> us with any, us in 2020. Us with all of our <laughs> loved ones. All right, they're working fast. Yeah, they have some pretty strong people. Very true. And they have gnomes who are really great at building stuff. They're getting out the T-Rex. Oh my goodness. Anime, yeah. They're making Gravity Falls into a mech. How sick is that? All right, very cool. Apocalypse sweaters, Mabel. The end of the world has never been so comfortable. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, fine, I'll wear it. This whole plan is bonkers. But of course, no one asks the chief what he thinks. Schmebulock. <laughs> You're acting grunklier than usual. It's this darn plan to save my brother. I already saved him once from <laughs> that portal. And he never thanked me. Yeah, that was pretty crazy. Trust me, tomorrow's gonna be great. Help, Leader Mabel. I keep accidentally flexing through my sweater. Oh, oh no. It happened again. Coming! Hmm. Those were the manly mo monsters. Mm-hmm. Wow. Here we go. Me, boy. Yeah, hyper flammable <laughs> merchandise is the only thing keeping me going. Huh. No, 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 no! Ready to talk now? Dang. I won't. I won't let you into my mind. Hey, do you hear that? Whoa. That's so cool. I'm loving the design. Oh, Whoa. Yeah. Shaktron. But it should be immune. God, they're huge. At least the center. I don't know about the appendages. <clears throat> yeah. Like, how far does the unicorn barrier extend? Yeah. This was a bad idea. <laughs> that's a lot of... That's a lot of firepower. We're gonna need some other mechs somehow. All right, dudes! Everyone, like we planned! Go! All right, with the cool remix. Perfect. You love a little guitar remix. Hell yeah. Oh, yeah, Waddles. Waddles. 
We could really use Neil deGrasse Tyson level uh, intelligence here. Yes. All right. I think Wendy gets the coolest clips. Yeah, right? Maybe Gompers will help, like the goat or something. Everybody, maximum power! <laughs> <laughs> the drumstick lore. That's funny. Well, they launched that thing. Dang. <laughs> Bravo, Dipper and Mabel! Well, would you look at that? Oh, the things those are gone. Really care about you. Perhaps torturing those kids will make you talk. No, no, not the kids, you can't. Oh, no. Can't touch it. Wow. Oh, extends the whole way. No. Awesome. No, 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 no. Let's go. Whoa. Ah, Gross. Getting rid of the eye is pretty huge. Yeah. We get in, rescue Ford, get out. Save he had the, the maximize beam. How is he going to use that? Maybe we can come up with a plan that doesn't involve us plummeting to our certain death. Now! <laughs> I'm loving the way every part of the story is being brought back. Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> Grappling hook. Their parachutes are so fun. Yeah. You know, Mabel made those. Mm hmm. Very stunning landing. Graceful. Yeah, just hook onto Wendy's yeah. dad. All right. <laughs> but how are we going to unfreeze them? I know. <gasps> oh, oh my goodness! He's been forcing me to do cute dances in his cage for eternity. I'm so tired of being cute. <laughs> oh no! Mayor Tyler, he's the load bearing <clears throat> human. Pull him out, and the whole thing goes down. He's <laughs> the only load bearing human. <laughs> wow. I think I'm dark and tortured for reals now. <laughs> experience will forever scar Tad Strange. <laughs> Mom! Dad! They're gonna be like, we don't care. <laughs> oh. Don't you ever scare me like that again! Oh! Very sweet. <laughs> Kids! Ah, uh, you did it! I knew I could count on you two! <laughs> Biddleford, I, I haven't seen you since we parted ways. You must hate me. I've tried forgetting. Maybe I should try forgiving. Come here, old friend. Oh. Remember how you told me right before you were frozen that you knew Bill's weakness? Yeah. Who's piloting the mech? Is it just is it just Auto? Seuss? Pencil, anything? Perfect. <laughs> is it like a return portal? Ah. Wow. From the intro. No, a prophecy. Who's going to be who in it? Wait, there was a llama All the in symbols. it. And it's the sweaters. Oh. It's the sweaters. That's so fun. Got to be. Yeah. The native people of Gravity Falls prophesied that these symbols could create a force strong enough to vanquish Bill. Wow. Oh, great news. But seeing you all here now, I finally understand that it's destiny, the pine tree. Yeah. Mabel, the shooting star. <clears throat> An excuse to stand next to Mabel. Oh. Turn this into a big deal. Oh, I won't. I won't. He, he will. <laughs> Dang, it's kind of giving him beating the brakes off him. Maybe it is auto. Nice work with the wow. Holy shit. Well, there goes all their time. Yeah. Cute. This is freaky. Now hold hands, everyone. Oh, and it's a perfect Do growth for thing no one in our family has ever done. Touch the hillbilly. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, Sans has gotta join hands with symbol? He's gotta join hands with his brother. You just need one more person. You realize this is a bunch of hogwash, right? Dude. You really think some caveman graffiti Look at your freaking hat. Dude. Oh, it's his hat. Yeah. Fine, just do one thing. Say thank you. I spent 30 years trying to bring you back. He did spend 30 years doing it, but now not, the, not time. the time. Not the time. Thank you. Between me and him, I'm not always the bad twin. Between him and me, Grammar Stanley. Oh, Grammar Stanley, you! You stuck up the No! Oh my god. Oh, come on. Oh no, it's Bill! Right? Isn't that what you're all thinking? 
Hold hands, please. So... God, they couldn't just set it aside for two seconds. They literally had it. Ultimate fumble. Damn. Can wow. You your voice yeah, ultimate fumble. There is... That sucks. They were so close. They it was already so starting close. to glow. Like, it was, like, literally proving that it worked. They literally had it. And they just had to bicker. Terrible. Well, <sighs> hopefully Damn. they can just rejoin hands, but... Not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. They really. Bill's here. I was gonna say, they didn't really get over it. Like, that'd be kind of crazy if he just vaguely said a thank you and then it ended. Yeah, but know? that was never gonna be solved in that moment. No, I agree. I more mean, like, there had to be something more. Yeah. Yeah. We'll see. You've brought every threat to my power together in one easy to destroy circle. Can you just hold hands right now? Hold please? hands. Oh my god, he's telling you? <sighs> Fuck. You All right. Oh god. Oh no. Oh, oh god. That's horrifying. <laughs> this castle could really use some decoration. Oh. Holy shit. Well. Looks like it's too late for your friends, Stanford. <laughs> kids! Tell me how to take care oh. global and I'll spare the kids. No, don't do it! I see everything now! <laughs> The maximizer. Oh, nice! They can just climb out. We'll take care of Bill. Watch, trust us. We beat him before. Uh, All right, one v oneing Bill. We're gonna see how this goes. Isn't it two v one? Yes, you're right. You two wait here. I've got some children I need to make into corpses. Oh. Oh God, that'll make them make up. Mm hmm. manifesting it. Yeah. The kids are gonna die and it's all my fault because I couldn't shake your stupid hand. I fell for all his easy flattery. You would have seen him for the scam artist he is. That's true. He was not nearly as gullible. Yeah. Street smart versus book smart. Yeah. If I didn't have this darn plate in my head, we could just erase him with the memory gun when he steps inside my mind. What if he goes into my mind? My brain isn't good for anything. <laughs> Can they... In your mind he wants. We need to take his deal. It's the only way he'll agree to save you and the kids. Yeah, they're not in a good place. No, they don't have a lot of bargaining no chips. Way out of here. When one door closes, choose a nearby wall and bash it in with brute force. Okay. All right. Oh no. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> Just ate it? God damn. Good choice. Uh, don't do it, Ford. My only condition is that you let my brother and the kids go. Fine. No. It's a deal. Oh no. <laughs> well, this is terrible. Yeah. What if you somehow learn to control his mind or something? Finally. Oh, they swapped. What? They swapped because they're twins. Very smart. Welcome to my mind. Surprised you didn't recognize it. The stubble's different. What? The deal's off! No, no, no! The okay. memory erase. Going down, Bill. Don't you realize you're destroying your own mind, too? It's not like I was what a sacrifice. Anyway. Wow. Huh. You made one fatal mistake. You messed with my family. You're making a mistake. I'll give you anything. He conned the con man. Yep. Yeah. That was awesome. Hell yeah. Oh. <laughs> Guess I was good for something after all. Oh. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Oh. Okay. So Stanley saved everybody. Wow. Wow. And everything's just back. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> and what is going to become of Stanley? Uncle Stan, you did it! Hey there, kiddo. Oh. What's your name? No. Oh. <laughs> Uncle Stan? 
Oh no. We had to erase his mind to defeat Bill. It's all gone. Stan has no idea, but he did it. He saved the world. He never got a true thank you. Come on. Our hero, Stanley. Is there any way he can get it back? I mean... Oh. This is a real nice place you got here. It's your place, Uncle Stan. Don't you remember? Even a little? Oh my god. Dude, you gotta stop. Who's that big guy crying in the corner? <laughs> no! I'm sorry, Stan's gone. I know my Grunkle is in there. It's not gonna end like no. that. Come on. This has to work. Here's the Scrapbooks. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't know what this is or who you are. Or... Ah, quit it, Waddles. I'm trying to remember my He knows Waddles. Waddles. Yay. I remember our boss employee relationship. Oh. Hey, because I have amnesia. Don't go trying to give yourself a raise, Zeus. Oh. <laughs> oh, yay. Okay, so Sweet. Grunkle Stan got his memory back. And... Thank goodness. Oh, that was going to be that were... horrible. That was tragic. But very innovative way to get rid of bill yeah definitely uh interesting they had that whole prophecy thing and they just didn't use it like mm -hmm. that's that's like fascinating to have that built up like that and then like bait and Go switch like direction. i really like that yeah 100 yeah. percent. anything to add i'm so glad that stan got to be the one to make the sacrifice you know like yeah. that sounds weird but like i just of all the people there he had the most to gain from making that sacrifice and then like being fine yeah and I, I feel like it evens the score between him and his brother and they'll probably be able to make a relationship now. exactly yeah. exactly nice let's see how it wraps up <laughs> nothing to see here get out of here you ornery critters hmm. oh, robbie would you be a deer and get us the sawed off shotgun <laughs> Brains and so forth. the mayor none of that thank you you <laughs> and if you break the rules, we're gonna zap you. We're mad with power. In love. Oh. <laughs> oh. After pledging his allegiance to Bill and then placing all his savings in weirdness bonds, Yikes. West had to sell his. Deserved. Money. You're only going to have one pony now. <laughs> I'm gonna buy me a bigger shed. Hey, that one's for sale. <laughs> and now bodacious tea with sports. It's called Death Ball. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, they got the birthday party. Thanks to y'all saving us, I learned to open my heart to kindness. I'm gonna try to be a little Gideon, regular old kid. I'm busting a move on this skating board. More like busting your pants, loser. <laughs> Love that the helmet's only for his hair. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Make a wish, dog. Still a weird kid. My only wish is for everyone to sign my scrapbook. I'll never forget you guys. Wait. Now I'll never forget you guys. Oh. I now officially declare you technically teenagers. When are you going to open your presents already? I broke a nail wrapping them. Oh, <laughs> that's kind of cute. Yeah. Stanley, I need to talk to you. We've got a problem. Oh, no. It has been contained, but I'm detecting... New anomalies near the Arctic Ocean. Fuck. I might be too old to go it alone. Are you saying you need someone to help you sail around the world in the adventure of a lifetime? Oh, the Stan Award. Oh. Want it to be you. Oh. Will you give me a second chance. What should we do with the mystery shack? I think the town's had enough mystery for one lifetime. Yeah. <laughs> thinking what I'm thinking. Demolish? No. A give it to give it to Zeus. I have an announcement to make. Me and my nerdy bro over here have some catching up to do. That's why I'm shutting down the mystery shack for good. You shut down your mouth for good. It's just that the shack is the most magical place on earth. Sure, the attractions are all fake, but dreams aren't fake. You shut down this shack and you shut down our dreams. At least my dreams. <laughs> Us. There's no one around to run it. At least. There wouldn't be if I hadn't just found Give him the hat. replacement. Ah! No. The mystery shack is under new management. Yay! And he's got the question mark. It's perfect. Fantastic. I leave it immediately. No longer a chair.
They're gone. Who is the author? The Waddles. Do you really have to go? Summer's over, Candy. It's heck of a summer. Uncle Stan, thanks for wearing my goodbye sweater. It's cold out, but it's like 80-something degrees out today. Can it? <laughs> <laughs> hey, you mean a lot to me, man. You too. <clears throat> Something to remember me by. Oh, and this. Read it the next time you miss Gravity Falls. Last bus leaving Gravity Falls. All right. Falls. All aboard. <laughs> okay. Guess we said goodbye to everyone except Waddles. Oh, you gotta bring He's Waddles. He's coming with. Mom and Dad won't let me bring a pig home to California, so. Oh, no. You have to stay here. No. Don't no. They're not gonna to me. work around. Make him tiny. Make him tiny. Ah, you know what? Forget it. I lived with this pig all summer. Now your parents are gonna have to. <laughs> Bringing animals aboard a moving vehicle is strictly prohibited by. <laughs> Welcome aboard. By lame people. <laughs> Front row, pig. <laughs> <laughs> they said, screw it. They could deal with it. You knuckleheads were nothing but a nuisance, and I'm glad to be rid of you. Oh. I miss you too, Uncle Stan. Ready to head into the unknown? Nope. Let's do it. Yeah, that's the attitude. Yeah. If you've ever taken a road trip through the Pacific Northwest, you've probably seen a bumper sticker for a place called Gravity Falls. <laughs> Do you see the gnomes? Yeah. Well, I've moved in. <laughs> Some people think it's a myth. But if you're curious, don't wait. <laughs> Take a trip. Oh, the theme song remix. Find it. Oh, <laughs> this is so sweet. Yeah. Wait. He already misses it. Oh. Wow. wow. All right. What a great show. I, don't know why. I feel the need to clap. Very nice. That was fantastic. That. What a great, great series. Mm -hmm. Any final thoughts on Gravity Falls? Uh, the series. I think it wrapped up super well. I'm really excited that Stan and Ford, like them mending their relationship is like a big part of the way the story ties up. Yeah, it was just, it, it, it was nice to have both the siblings not happy with each other for the last part and then exactly. both resolve it. Like, yeah, 100%. I feel like this tied up in a really tight bow. Yeah, Everybody got a great absolutely. ending. And Seuss with the mystery shack. Yeah, I was going to say, because he was going to be the only one left alone, but like, you know what? He has the mystery shack. He has everybody else. And mm -hmm. <laughs> um, But, uh, ah, man, I'm just... I'm still thinking about all those things that happened. That was such a great ending. Yeah. I went, so oh, that was perfect. Well, that's the end. Well, thank you for watching our series. Uh, it has been, so oh, maybe he's still alive. Maybe he's in our world now. Maybe. I don't know why I keep thinking his name is Pippin Paddleopsicopolis. It's Bill Cipher. We can literally push off anything. We can create our own leverage. Whoa. That's a cool concept. That is very cool. I like the way they're explaining it. Yeah. But Try it a little more like this. Like what? Don't. Oh. But that is where we are left for Gravity Falls. Incredible series. Uh, and I cannot thank you guys enough for watching all 40 episodes with us. It was so fun. Anything you want to add before we move on? I mean, this is just the, like, this is just the coolest thing ever. Getting to watch these episodes and these shows and talk about it with you guys. And it, like, I there aren't words for how amazing this is and how lucky we are and we we don't take it lightly um yeah so thank you we really really appreciate it and this is it's so fun it's so it's fun. so fun we love getting to watch you guys' recommendations and then just move on to the next series and uh we're still gonna remember a lot about gravity falls but uh on to the next one but before we do that make sure to comment down below any series that you'd be interested after invisible interested in after invincible could be has been hotel could be dragon prince could be steven universe could be legend of vox machina or could be something else just let us know we have a lot to discuss before we do that where are we headed all right let's review thank you for watching and uh if you're excited for invincible coming next week make sure to tune in next tuesday at 12 p.m eastern standard time if you can't wait these episodes are all posted to patreon right now
All right, question one. How fitting do you find it that the key to defeating the series' most selfish and self-serving entity was the willingness to make such a selfless sacrifice? And do you find the solution afterwards was a cop-out or an earned resolution? Um, I think it was perfect. I think I think the fact that that ending would have made no sense for like Stan early on in the show, but in the end, it made absolute perfect sense for his character. It's such a cool way to show like his character arc in conjunction with like the main thing of the story. And then in terms of the end, I think it maybe could have taken a little longer. To get his memory back? Yeah. But I don't think the idea of like seeing a memory book and being reminded of things bringing back your memory is a cop out. I think it's a little bit of a cop out, like that it was just like memory eraser and they were like, not really. No, like, the fact that it was so fast out, but was you know what? like very like. I didn't want this to be a sad ending series. So like, do it. Like, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah. Power of friendship. Yeah, I, uh, I, I don't hate it as a cop-out, but I do think it is a funny little ending just to have it, like, all those things bring it back. I think Waddles being the keys makes a lot of sense. 100%. Like, an animal doing that would be yeah. a lot to trigger mm -hmm. in your brain. Um, but, uh, I just love, I can't get over the conning the con man, and also the bait and switch of not using that symbol we've seen the whole series. Like, I was so expecting it to be something big, and it could have worked, but knowing there were several solutions, like Brecht said, the best stories uh, often have two different ways it could have gone and still been a good ending. That's um, a good point. Which it, oftentimes most decisions within the, his shows were thought to be like, what would happen either way? There shouldn't only be one way something happens. Right, because if someone made a different decision, how would the story turn out? Exactly, and if there's no room for a different decision, then you're writing a very thin story. That's, yeah. No, 100%. Yeah, but uh, anyway, let's go to our final question. Final question. Annabella asks, what do you think of how each character's storyline wrapped up? Are you satisfied with where everyone is at the end? How much are you crying right now? I definitely cried several times during that finale. It's very sweet. I cried a lot earlier today, so I did not cry, but I was very moved. Oh, this is kind of a thing on the earlier point we were making. The fact that in the end, the inability to distinguish Stan and Ford was like the thing that saved them. I don't know, I feel like their differences were always conveyed to be like the reason that they didn't get along. So for it in the end to all work out because they can play each other so convincingly, that's a very cool way of showing that like they understand each other now. Yeah, absolutely. I, uh, I loved that. And in terms of character endings, going down the line, I think like Seuss's ending of getting the shack makes a lot of sense. I think Seuss is probably my favorite. Um, yeah, I, uh, I think my favorite's the two brothers going back on the boat, the Stan of War 2. Yeah. Which no, is just like the dream. I, I could, the Waddles way Waddles coming back Stan, to California. They're all my favorite. Yeah, they all had great endings. And uh, I just wish we got like Gravity Falls Shippuden, which is like, would be like a sequel series. Oh. Um, there, Naruto Shippuden was like the, the second time skip, time skip series. Yeah. Isn't Naruto already like a thousand episodes? Naruto, the original series, is like 200, and then Shippuden's like 500. Oh, okay. So the second half was really gotcha. large. But anyway, um, all the characters' endings were really great. Uh, Bodacious T getting a job on the news. Hell yeah. Love that. Um, and uh, yeah, you really can't ask for a better ending for a series. Yeah. I'm very satisfied. Very happy. And with happy that, wrap up. Yeah, with that being said, I think it's time to move on to our next series, Invincible. Are we excited for episode one of Invincible? Can't we? All right, let's get it. Let's go. Let's go.